What's going on everybody? It's Patrick Minton Outdoors. How is my outdoor crew doing? Hope this video is finding you well. Special video for Saturday. It's a mail call. Um, a very cool mail call. Well, they're all cool, but this one's got a little extra spice in it, shall we say. Now, working on the garage, you kind of wonder why things look a little weird. Um, because I'm actually using this is my tripod right now because my tripod is over there i can't set it up because i'm moving this out of here to get the garage set up is my full-time studio uh, once all that gets taken care of hopefully in the next couple weeks uh, me and chase still have a lot to go through and a lot to get rid of um, it's just some of it's just it's it's done it needs to go so i'm hauling off small loads at a time but tonight i've got to put that that in the bed of the truck because i'm taking off to uh land between the lakes this weekend for the day on saturday um it's supposed to rain saturday night late into sunday morning all day uh matter of fact they're calling for storms so i'm gonna take off early saturday morning we're gonna drive up we're gonna hang out at old at uh land between the lakes do some soft wheeling shall we say but uh i want to get this mail call done and taken care of Whoop. sorry about that i want to get this mail call done and taken care of because i appreciate the mail calls this one like i said is special it's a little spicy when i say it's a little spicy there's a lot that came with it um cool little note uh thanks for the note and everything but uh in case you don't know who it is and i'll leave a link down below and then of course i'll leave a thing at the end here it is mark kratz mc it's not focusing i don't know why but he sent me a couple stickers sent me his business card um says just thought i'd let you know i enjoy your channel and content i appreciate that you are involved in scouting now, I'm since retired from scouting, but I still, every now and then, I do some things for buddies of mine that need... Anyway, Boy Scouts were a big part of my life. Me too. Um, Eagle Scout, class of 87, that's me. My son made arrow light, and he got the fumes. We know that story. I was four merit badges away from Eagle. Ugh, that, trust me. And then joined the Air Explorers, which is sounds like that's pretty cool too. Needless to say, my dad wasn't happy at the time, but I had done everything up to senior patrol leader, instructor, order the arrow. I did all that too. Matter of fact, I, I eventually went to the scoutmaster and said, "Y'all gotta find somebody else to do senior patrol leader." Because I, you know, I was like senior patrol leader for almost two years. I'm like, dude, I just want to. I just want to be me. I don't want to be in charge of everybody anymore. Had fun, but anyway. Went to Philmont. Missed, didn't get to do that. And even visited the Boy Scout Museum. That's something I'd like to go to. It's in Texas. I always thought all I needed to succeed in life. I was taught all I needed to succeed in life. And I agree with that. The basic Boy Scout program does teach great things for men of course now women to succeed in life as long as it doesn't lose its teaching i don't know i'm conflicted on the whole women in there but at the same time you know um i, I don't know I'm, I'm gonna stop right there on that um was what was included in the boy scout handbook yes the boy scout handbook i highly recommend if you're looking for something for outdoors for basic knowledge pick up a boy scout handbook from somewhere used one they're awesome the field book is even better pick it up um the lesson served me well through my military and law enforcement careers salute military uh, you know how I am about military. Uh, matter of fact, one of the deals I got on the back window of my truck is for soldiers' children, um, soldiers' child ride. 
didn't get to do it this year we'll be back next year um take care and good luck with your channel and always remember be prepared hey, that's what i say <laughs> just kidding so anyway mark kratz mark kratz mc on youtube now i'm gonna put a sticker over on the fridge with everybody else and all the great people over there but he sent me something else which i will have to i will have to reach out p.s enclosed our stamps from the from 1986 fish stamps and the other one from 1960 keep them or if there is a scout who is into stamp collecting pass them on well it's kind of funny i have the stamp collecting merit badge and matter of fact i still have my stamps from then and so there's some oldies in that collection one day i'll find them and well i won't say find them i know where they are but here's the ones some of the ones he sent and then he said the fish ones which is kind of ironic these have never been opened so i don't want to open these things which oh my gosh they're cool on the inside but this has never been opened and there was 10 20 cent stamps for two dollars and fifty cents come on focus camera that is pretty cool uh tell you what mark i'm gonna keep them for myself for now if i do wander upon a scout that is taking the stamp collecting merit badge i will pass them on um i have actually passed on some rocks for a kid that was doing um the uh what is it geology geologist anyway I've, I've helped a lot of scouts over the years and still do from afar i still donate even um you know all these years i still donate every year to the scouting program uh but anyway enough chit chat i'm gonna go put this on my fridge and i'm gonna take y'all with me come on let's go this sticker's on there like i said when i say this garage is a disaster right now it's a disaster so let's take a look real quick let's take a look at all these um all right cat in the north ak driller me hiking with sean on youtube kurt zitzelman mr bullet points the real cobra burnout travels with delaney andy camper glad to see you back brother he travel happy awesome native tears gotta go back ten deer stalker outdoors be seeing you in may brother james g outdoor ct rva hiker girl wish i could get her to come down to that youtuber meetup i'd like to meet her in person super cool lady if you've never seen her videos go check them out um she wears out virginia and little side note i have relatives that live in virginia so judy spirit nicholson family homestead barb's country home youtube get dirty with nature the nature man hey where you at brother michael brunner what's up man plain old chuck eat carbs hey go check out his cooking videos dude is like he needs to open a restaurant Cindy Squirrel, out and about with Ron, get outdoors, Ron and friends, modern tent camping, see you in May. I've heard he's coming back in May. Woohoo! TCO. Hey, dude. Come down to Tennessee for the meetup. I'd like to see you. Swamp Stalker Outdoors, I'll be seeing you in May. Pine Life. Hope to get to see him in May. He's a cool dude. All these people are cool dudes. And there you are, Mark. Right underneath, eat carbs. Mark. Mark. Oh. I just realized. Mark and Mark are together on the beer fridge. Once again, Mark, thank you so much for the stickers and the stamps. I will be putting those in my stamp collection because I do have a vast stamp collection. And I'm pretty sure I don't have any of those fish ones, but I'm going to leave that book closed. It'll work, make it worth more down the road. Maybe my grandchildren will find it and realize what's going on. Um, anyway, that's it. Hopefully when this video comes out, 
I'll be up at Land Between the Lakes, me and the old Titan. So if you see that beast rolling around up at Land Between the Lakes this weekend and you're out and about in Land Between the Lakes, give me a shout. I'll have my stickers with me and say, hey, I want that on the road again sticker and you'll get it. Man, I look bald since I got my hair cut. Good Lord. Anyway, um, I got to shave. But uh, like I said, I'm going to get out of here Saturday morning early. Head up to Land Between the Lakes. I think I may start dead smack in the center and work my way south. I think um, I'm still drawing that up. So keep an eye out for the Titan. If you see the Titan, remember what's on the back. I'm actually fixing to throw another sticker on the back of it. Uh, right there, I've got National Park Geek sticker to put on. But if you see that Tennessee State Park sticker and that U.S. Forestry Service and Darth Vader, because that's the name of the truck, is Vader. And all that, you know that's me. Give me a shout. Flash your lights. Do something. Get my attention. Let's hang out. And don't forget, man, this is going to be a longer video than I meant for it to be. But don't forget, if we collab together in person, I have a coin for you. So if we get together and do a collab in person, I have a coin that I'm going to give you that I made in that mess in there. <laughs> this is to be gone. I can't wait until all this is gone. And I can set up my studio properly the way I want it and so all right guys that's it for this one i appreciate you watching this saturday i've got some more videos coming and we'll see you soon i'm right here it's starting wow there it goes be prepared <laughs>